In spite of a, a pretty epic price war and still no new Model Y in China, Tesla just sold nearly 75,000 cars in the country. This to me is a bit of a surprise. What is really interesting to me though is having a look at Tesla's sales for the entire first six months of this year. In fact, no, we now have data for the first seven months of the year. We can compare the first seven months of this year versus the first seven months of last year. It kind of reveals some interesting trends. Hello, my friends, welcome to the channel. I'm Sam Evans, you're watching The Electric Viking. I'll be at the Melbourne EV show on the 9th and the 10th of August. I'll put a link in the description, guys. You can get tickets there very, very cheap, and my link will give you a cheaper price on tickets. They're about 60% cheaper than what tickets were for the Sydney EV show, everything electric. So yeah, check it out, it'll be great. Tesla China sales. Sales of Chinese made Tesla vehicles recovered last month. Pretty good month, I think. Tesla sold 74,120 vehicles in July. That does include though vehicles that were sold in China and sold outside of China. That's an increase of 4.4% from June. In June, Tesla sold 71,000. That was up 15.3% from 64,000 in the same period last year. So actually these last couple of months, Tesla sales figures from their Chinese factory have been better than last year. But still overall, Tesla are down versus last year. First seven months of this year, Tesla delivered 500,000 vehicles, 500,740. But that is a reduction of 7.4% versus last year. I still think that's a pretty good number. 7.4% decline, considering everyone's waiting for the new Model Y. They only have two vehicles. One of them has been upgraded, but the more by far the more popular vehicle is the Model Y. And everyone knows there's a new version coming. The, the existing version, it's a bit dated, a bit getting a bit old now. It's still a great car. But I think what really surprises me is that it's still selling so well, considering everything I just said. And look, look at the competition. The competition now have fast charging, longer range, um, probably more luxury, um, better designs. Those are all facts, right? Just objective facts. Uh, and still Tesla is selling incredibly well. Software, of course, Tesla still has the best software, in my opinion, hands down. Tesla has a factory in Shanghai. It makes the Model 3 and it makes the Model Y. Tesla does have another factory in, in China right now. It's a mega factory. It's just building a mega factory to build energy storage battery packs. And that that mega factory will probably make as much profit, even though it's a fraction of the size of Tesla's Gigafactory. And the reason is because Tesla has to sell 500 cars, 500 cars to make as much profit as it does from one single mega pack battery. And that's why I think maybe I should move away from reporting guys on just Tesla China sales. I think I know a lot of people are interested in, maybe I should include Tesla China mega pack sales. Now, I need to find a way of figuring those numbers out month by month. That would be good to know. We do know that Tesla's energy storage division just blew up like crazy in the second quarter of this year to 9.4 gigawatts. Their previous high was four gigawatts. And then Tesla signed a contract for 15 gigawatt hours with one single client. That is astronomical. Anyhow, getting back to cars. First half, um, you can see Tesla sales here. This chart is from CNET Post and it gives you a good idea here of what Tesla is doing in China. The last three months, Tesla has been pretty steady at just over 70,000 deliveries. But you can see here, December, or actually November of last year, Tesla hit over 100,000. It's amazing. Uh, obviously then Tesla had a, a bit of a down month in April this year, but overall Tesla sales are going, I mean, 7% decline, I think is a really good result considering, yeah, the Juniper version of the Model Y will be a much better car, much, much, much significantly improved over Tesla's existing car. But I'm curious to know, what's this new car gonna be that Tesla said? They're gonna build on the same production lines, it'll be cheaper, more affordable, new cars, uh, plural, as in multiple new cars. Could it just be cheaper versions of the Model Y and the Model 3? Potentially, maybe, could be, I don't know. But Tesla said they're gonna be here in the first quarter of 2025. I've got no idea what they're going to be, but I'm really curious to know. Guys, those are the sales numbers here for Tesla. So 71,000. Last month was about 70,000. The month before that was about 70,000. And yeah, you can see Tesla sales here are pretty steady at their factory in China. Thanks for watching.